This is Cricket World TV with me, John Pennington, and Amit Masson. We're looking ahead to the 2011 World Cup. What about the prospects for Bangladesh then, Amit? A lot of headlines made when they named their squad. No place in it for former captain Mashraf Mortaja. Great shame for him, but no great surprise. Absolutely. Unexpected lines, though, because he uh, is coming, uh, is actually nursing an injury. That would mean that he would not take part in the World Cup. Now, as expected, they've loaded their squad with spinners, but who would you pick out as their key players, men to watch, who might just win them some games? I think Tamim Iqbal at the top of the order will uh, be a handy man for Bangladesh to get them off to good starts and uh, probably play as many as overs as he can. And uh, what about the captain, Shakib Al Hassan? He's got a huge role to play, hasn't he? Absolutely. I think uh, from uh, making important decisions uh, to ringing in the right bowling changes, and of course, he himself can bowl uh, with, uh, with good uh, efficacy in, in the later stages of the innings. Certainly the key man for Bangladesh. Now, they're in a tough group, that Group B, but uh, could they do it again and make it through to the later stages of the competition as they did in 2007? John, it really depends on uh, what kind of totals they produce. And those totals will give the bowlers a chance to bowl something at. So it really depends on the totals that they produce and then... Probably from there on in, it's their bowling department that will take care. Great stuff. Well, for me, it could come down to the game against the West Indies to see if Bangladesh will indeed progress to the quarterfinals. It's going to be fantastic to see if they can do it. Thank you for watching Cricket World TV.